Welcome back to our CNC tutorial series. In the last video, we touched on some primary types of CNC machines like milling machines, lathes, routers, and grinders. Today, let's expand our horizons and explore a few more varieties within the world of CNC. Let's dive in. First off, we have CNC laser cutters. They employ focused laser beams to cut or engrave a wide array of materials, from wood and plastics to metals and even glass. Laser cutters typically operate in the X and Y axes, but some advanced models can incorporate a Z axis for depth control. Next up, we have CNC water jet machines. These machines use a high pressure jet of water, often mixed with an abrasive substance to cut through materials. The major advantage of water jet machines is that they produce no heat, making them perfect for materials that are sensitive to high temperatures. Something that may surprise you is that there are even CNC sewing machines. These machines use programmable patterns to automate the sewing process, enhancing speed and precision. They're commonly used in industries like fashion and upholstery, and there are many more. From CNC routers that excel at cutting large panels of material to specialized CNC machines like electrical discharge machines and hot wire cutters. Each machine, in its own way, leverages the precision and efficiency that computer numerical control brings to the table. The world of CNC is both vast and varied. Understanding the capabilities of different machines helps us appreciate the incredible versatility of CNC technology. Regardless of the machine type, the common thread is the use of G-code to control and automate the process. That's all for this video. In our next episode, we'll dive back into the world of G-codes and their applications across these various machines. Until then, keep exploring and happy machining.